Hello, Bulldogs. For our next effect, we are going to learn what is known as a motion tween. Not a classic tween, but a motion tween. I'm going to add a layer by clicking on the new layer button. I'm going to type in the word motion for the name of my effect. I'm going to insert a few frames. Insert a keyframe where I want my animation to start. For this one, I'm going to use the shape tool that we're familiar with. Over here, I'm going to make my fill green and my stroke black. And I'm going to make my stroke about 10 or 12, actually 13. I'm going to draw a little ball here. Now, it's important to go ahead and convert this to a symbol, because if you don't, when you try to move this, the fill moves and the stroke does not move with it. So simply draw a big box around this, right-click, convert to symbol, I'm going to call it ball, and click OK. Once you notice that it now has a little box around it, and there's a you can kind of move it. I'm going to put this up in the corner. And this is so easy, you're going to say, Mr. Wickwar, why didn't you show this that a while back? I'm going to right-click and choose Create Motion Tween, not Classic, Motion Tween. And all you do here is you move the bar a little bit, and then you move your ball a little bit. And then you move the ball bar a little bit, and move your ball a little bit. Move it a little bit more. Move it a little bit more, kind of like it bounced on the ground here. Move it all the way to the end. And we're going to shoot it off the screen. And now if I just rewind that, we have a ball that follows a certain motion. You can even go on here, similar to an illustrator, and with the selection tool, you can kind of adjust the entire track. Or with the selection tool, come in here with some of these and stretch them just a bit. See the way I'm a little curve is at the end of my mouse there? We can kind of curve this to make our trajectory, I guess the word is called, a little more realistic. Now if I rewind it, notice that my trail has changed a little bit. But it's called a motion tween. Pretty cool.